Surprise, surprise. Friday night date night. Yeah, Friday night date night. I should get some really cool music for it. I should, because I have so many projects going on and it is Friday. It's Friday before the sun goes down. And uh, it's awesome. It's like, it feels like, it feels like Friday night, date night. So the first thing I want to share with all of you is what's going on here with the RV. Um, I am creating a garden. I always said you can't take the homesteading girl out of me. And I'm going to have some uh, tutorials on how to garden out of an RV. But uh, you're going to get a sneak peek. Um, so what I've been doing, oh, this is so, this is so cool. This is so cool. So I'll show you. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm taking all the stuff that obviously is from my off-grid lifestyle and, and my lifestyle throughout my, my whole life. And even though we didn't live off-grid, we lived in the north woods of Wisconsin. And, you know, come on, I'm a taxidermist wife. That's what I used to be. So, you know, wrap your head around that. You know, me skinning out deer heads, you know. Come on, you know, I did. Skinning out coyote, helping with all that stuff. So, you know, started off a long time ago with the canning and all that stuff. And I even had my very first garden back in Wisconsin. It was just a tiny garden. And I used lots of pots. And then I kind of dug up the ground. Didn't know anything about back to Eden gardening. But now, I've, I've come into full circle and full bloom. And I want to show you what I'm doing here for the RV garden. So um, I am, number one, trying to be as frugal as possible uh, because, you know, when you live out in an RV, it's not like the money's pouring in, right? Um, but God always is good with giving us resources, but we got to use our noggin, right? So a uh, couple things. I did have to buy some soil. The soil around here in Georgia not so good. But I did go to um, two garden centers and I did pick up some um, potting mix. And these are all uh, repurposed pots. Uh, and, and actually, I got, I got those for free. And I also got, this is a really groovy idea, uh, I got some of those black pots that you get from the garden center and what I'm what I'm doing right now is I'm painting them. Yeah, I'm painting. See? Okay. What else is going on? Oh, there's so much going on. Uh, I cleaned up the RV. Today was cleaning day. And one of the things that we're working on, you see this? This isn't my, me. I feel, <laughs> poor Victoria's husband. <laughs> I like does it feel like you got two two wives? He says, "No, a wife and a friend." <laughs> but he just ran to town because See this seat here, this chair? I want to take this out so I can open up this area. And once it's open up, I'm thinking about, because I'm going to go be, be visiting my brother back in Wisconsin, building some very shallow shelves to come here in an L shape so I have a little bit more storage space for odds and ends, but this will just stay open. Uh, I just need a little more room. Like you see over here, see I have my weights out. I just started lifting weights and I have to be very careful just simply because uh, if I move wrong, I, I still feel the back. You know, my, my back pain isn't 100% gone. It is still there. It's lingering. So as, as a nurse and a professional, it's telling me you still have to be very careful with the herniation that you walked around with for six months. So I'm being smart. but. Since it's Friday night, well, let's just, just do something fun um, besides just telling you what else I'm doing. Oh, you know, I'll tell you what. Um, I'm going to show you some of the RV stuff that I've been working on. As you see, everything is, is really getting organized. Um, it's nice and clean now. And, it, it, and you may say, well, it looks a little cluttered. Uh, you know, I, I like cluttered. But everything has its place. Um, the one thing, look at, see all this beautiful bottled water? I have a Berkey uh, travel size uh, water filter system now. Came in out of the blue. I mean, it just it just showed up uh, unmarked. Didn't know who sent it. And well, later on, I found out who sent it. it. It is it's a blessing, and I never even thought about water. I need clean water on the road. We all need water, right? Well, I got this RV traveling water filter, and I've been filling up my bottles, and now I don't have to purchase water. Wherever I go, I'm going to have water. 
Uh, so that's what all this is about. But uh, look at what my si my my sister, oh, my sister, my girlfriend. Well, she is my sister. Bought at Big Lots. Let me close this up. That's my that's my fruit hanger, and I love it, love it, love it. She got it for like four bucks, and I use this other one for odds and ends. You know, it's all about storage, right? It's all about storage. And I bought these hangers that hold hold on the door, so now I can hang all my hanging clothes there without needing a real closet. This is the bathroom, and this is all storage, because I'm not using the shower, I'm not using the toilet. But when I get to Wisconsin, we're gonna take that toilet out, just rip it out of there, and I will use my compost toilet. And when, when it, the time comes if I need a shower, I can just take that out of there because I do have a lot of extra extra space. Um, this is my closet that used to be a hanging closet. And how I organize is I use all these cloth containers and I just fold up my clothes. Everything's folded real neat. My towels are on top. And uh, Victoria's husband did that for me. I got some great people in my life. I think you've seen this before. This is where my supplements go. See, all in here. And I am finding out that uh, what's really important, and this is just a kind of a ditty if you uh, have been diagnosed with any type of cancer or your immune system is compromised, uh, or you have pain and inflammation, uh, curcumin is, with turmeric root is really, that's what you want to be taking. And of course the black seed oil. Uh, I have, I do both. I do it in liquid form, which really tastes nasty. And then um, a lovely friend sent me that and said, why don't you try the that form instead, the capsule form. And of course this is a little bit easier, but I know it looks like a lot of supplements. Every supplement that I have is natural, it's not synthetic. Somebody had made a comment about, you don't need any supplements, God provides everything for you. Well, he does. And all those supplements are natural. They're, they're, they're natural. Uh, turmeric is, is, is natural, turmeric root is natural, and I actually do buy turmeric root when I can find it. I got some on sale for like cheap, like two bucks. Uh, and I do a lot of ginger and I do a lot of garlic. But this is my little space. It's looking pretty good, isn't it, for, for Friday night. I cleaned it up for Friday night. And we're gonna try to get this captain's seat out of there. And there's little Mario. It has been so hot. It's been so hot. But let's go out here. Oh, and I just wanna show you, that's my outside refrigerator. In fact, I probably should check it because this is where I keep my extra produce. And, oh, it's pretty cold. Looks good. Okay, so I'm inside. This is Friday night inside my girlfriend's house. And um, the, her husband went to go get some stuff so he can unbolt it. Feel, I feel bad for him. I feel bad for him. Like, this was supposed to be a five, we said, five minute job, you know, and now we're, he's in town. But I just want to show you, this is the Berkey uh, filter that I received as a gift. And I don't know if you can see in there, there, those are the carbon filters. And all you do is you pour the water in there and it filters through. And they even say, do the dye test, take red dye water and it will come out clear. Pretty cool. So a lot of the times, well, most of the time now, this is what I use for my water source. And we take it right from the tap. So whatever is coming out of the tap that goes through the Berkey, you're gonna have fresh water. That was, that was a blessing. That was really a blessing. Uh -uh the blessing but other little things uh this is my uh, uh kale and my girlfriend taught me this she said in fact it needs a little bit of water when i bring home my greens now i cut the ends off and it will last longer if you put it in a cup of water mm -hmm. a cup of water so now i also want to show you we have dueling juicers look at that which one is mine can you guess clean and sparkly a little miscombobulated. <laughs> Hers, mine. But you know, I did a pretty good job. You know, I, 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 what I like to do is I put the bags in here so all my stuff gets shoot, shoots in here. Her, she does the same thing. I learned that actually from her. Put a bag in your juicer's chute so you don't have to wash it. You just take the bag and if you've got a compost pile, you can simply bring it out to your compost pile and then you don't have to wash it. But um, the Breville was also a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful gift. A wonderful 
gift. And I was, my sister was actually, was my sister here when I got it? I don't think she was, but she, she, she filmed me unboxing it with Victoria and we were both just blown away. So, um, see, Friday night is awesome. Not too much going on inside here, but you know, um, I, I stay in here a lot. I use their ice, I use their water. This is where I wash my clothes. I pretty much live in here. And like the other day I was in here and I, I was in my underwear and her husband walked in and I'm like, don't come in, don't come in. He's like, oh, 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 and I said, well, it's not that bad. I mean, just don't come in, I'm in my underwear. So, you know, it's kind of funny. Okay, we are having technical difficulties. So the husband went to Ace and they, can, they sold him this, which he needed, right? but not the mechanism to keep it on the drill so that it doesn't slip. It's a hardware store. Nope, didn't have the piece. Nope, so that's what's going on right now for Friday night, yeah. We're just in what waiting. But About from dinner. your point, is my blade straight up and down? Yeah, well, yeah, it's that definitely straight up and down. All right, that's what I'm looking for. Here we go. All right. One bolt. That's only one bolt. Oh man. This is taking a long time. This is tough. It's working. We're, look at this. We ground off. He grounded off the top of the nut. And look. 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 Yeah. I think it all moved. Oh yeah, it's completely loose now. But... Uh. Awesome! Awesome! Look at all the room. Look at, 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 Friday night. I got room. That's so cool. Where is he? Where did you put the chair? I got There we go. There, say goodbye to the chair. Goodbye chair. Friday night. What, what did he say? Have a seat. Have a seat. 